Hello, my name is Rich Howard, owner of Architectural Builder Supply, and this video is to bring you a closer look at the AJW part number U180A in a TK version, which is a turn knob version. I'm going to be real careful when you're cutting through this material. Don't let much of the blade stick through because it's very possible that the material that you would not want to cut is immediately below. And indeed, that's the case. You get in there too deep with your with your blade, and you're going to score the face of that pretty bad. Okay, um, so this is what it is. The U180A is a smaller version, a more petite version of the surface-mounted um, uh, paper towel holder, is what it is. That's what it looks like. It has some material here. I have a feeling it's probably mounting screws. This white surface you see is of course just the peel away protective film covering the stainless steel okay now the u180 is a larger version of this it's just simply taller is what it is let's take a look at the dimensional properties of this item now let's take some basic dimensional properties of this and then we're going to move to the um, links that are down below this video Overall width, about 10 and 7 eighths, as you can see. Overall projection of the unit, looks like it's about 4 inch. It's going to have an overall height of about 8 and an eighth. Okay. So this is the U180A, again the more petite version, and we're going to touch on the catalog. The TK in the part number, that tells us that this is the uh, thumb turn, thumb turn version. Okay. So why would you want a thumb turn? Well, I mean, you probably want a thumb turn because you have an environment where there's, there's frankly no reason to have a key lock over it. You might have a teacher's lounge and, you know, you don't expect theft uh, in the teacher's lounge restroom. So a thumb turn is nice and easy for obviously being able to refill that. You know, just my, you know, guess as to where exactly it is that you might um, end up using uh, a thumb turn style model. It is definitely very handy, um, there being not a lock at times. We have the same environment here where we don't, we have, we need paper towels, we just have no need to lock them up. Okay, now let's take a look at the extended description information down below. Okay, now it says down below that we've got a stainless steel paper towel dispenser that's surface mounted, that is fabricated, fabricated of 22 gauge stainless steel with a number four satin finish, secured with a pin tumbler lock, with twist lock, uh, so that uh, description that's there will be amended to secured with a thumb turn style twist lock. We'll, we'll update that. Made uh, with a heavy duty piano hinge, they call it, and that's what you see down here. I don't know that I would necessarily call this heavy duty, but I would certainly call it up to the task. Okay. Holds 200 C fold or 325 multi fold towels. And then the general specifications are again listed down there. Goes on to a little bit further detail in terms of what we've just already covered. Let's take a move to the two links that are below this video to the product uh, brochure along with the tech sheet. The tech sheet will be some uh, a, a, an overview of what we've already gone over, but let's dive into those documents now. Okay, now taking a look at the information in the extended description the cut the tech sheet that's there again just an overview of everything the dimensional properties gives you a recommended towel dispensing height of 40 inch above the finished floor to meet ada code we'll talk more about ada code in a moment uh, then there's the product brochure and that's handy because it will allow you to review all of the towel dispensers from ajw and we get to, as we scroll through, we'll find the U180A. Okay. TK, which is not pictured, same, but with a twist lock in lieu of a keyed lock. Larger version is indeed, again, the U180. The U180 is, is by far more common. This will hold 400 C-fold 
or 525 multi-fold towels. And the A just gives you, again, the petite version of that U180. But as you look through the balance of this document, many of these items are, are certainly common. Very, some, something very low cost uh, when you want to just dispense regular rolled paper towels, just regular paper towels that you'd see in the kitchen. Okay, this is a uh, vanity surface mounted style. That's nice because it installs down into the vanity. Hands free style is here. Other variants of that, of course, the ratcheting lever style is here. Then I said we'd talk about that ADA. Let's take a look at that. On the manufacturer's page, there is a link to the ADA standards for accessible guide uh, book. ADA was a law passed in uh, 1991, I believe, uh, federal law, and this is the governing document when it comes to all um, requirements in terms of um, the construction in public spaces to allow uh, usage by those that are handicapped, and of course restrooms are front and center in that discussion, you would be able to search the document, say grab bars, um, uh, and you'll be able to get to plumbing elements and facilities in chapter six, okay? Section three, uh, 603 of chapter six, toilet and bathing rooms on page 160. You get down into page 160 and then you're going to start to see everything as it uh, pertains to to restrooms. So if you're not sure of where you should be mounting stuff, this would be the document to dive into. But that 40 inch dimension is the uh, is the distilled information coming out of this document. It's not what AJW says, it's what's coming out of the ADA design, um, the, the design requirement to be compliant with the law. Okay, let's wrap up this video. Okay, so here we are, the uh, manufacturer's page that we just uh, took you to. You'd be able to not only review all of the um, AJW products that we sell, but also a link to the manufacturer's website, as well as a link to the full product catalog. This is a nice unit that you'll use in those applications where you obviously don't need a key and you don't need the same sort of 400 C-fold uh, mount sort of uh, capacity. Uh, lower volume would be pretty typical on this where you don't need a ton of uh, paper towels at one time uh, to be available. If there are any questions on the AJW, this is their part number U180A in a TK variant or any other, uh, oh gosh, any other AJW product, please feel free to reach out to us. That package, I almost forgot to show those to you. There are fasteners included. Don't expect there to be fasteners included with um, all items. And in, in my experience, they generally are not but this appears to be a number 10 by maybe one inch pan head style sheet metal screw. And that's obviously going to allow you to install it via the keyhole style okay, prep setter here. There is one fixed hole. Um, I suppose you might utilize that fixed hole should you um, not want to just loosen the screws and lift it off the wall, I suppose. Uh, but otherwise, that's why those are there. You mark all your points and then you install it. And looking at the tech sheet again, they do not give you those mounting points. So let me do that now because I've had people call and say, I would really love to know what those mounting points are because I want to match the existing unit that I have. So if we were going to go basically to the center, I would say we'd be about nine and a sixteenth to the center of our holes. Then I would say that a center to center vertically would be closer to about five inch. Okay. Hopefully those holes or those dimensions help you determine that. Any questions on the U180A and a TK or any other AJW product, please feel free to reach out to us. And thank you.